<laughs> yes, you are. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. Hi, Merry baby. Vlogmas Day 4. Show them your cut on your nose. It's focusing on the cereal behind you. Guys, battle wounds, battle scars. Max got a big cut on his nose in this game yesterday. Two days ago. Yeah. Yesterday. Oh, yesterday. It's like all healed already. It looks like a scab. Yeah, it's messed up. Yay. You're so tough. Yep. It was his visor, in case you guys are wondering. I made some avocado toast quick because I realized I like barely ate dinner yesterday. I ate like trail mix. So <laughs> I needed avocado toast. About to go pick up Arlen and Maggie to go meet Emma. And we're going to go to Thinking Cup to get their matcha because they still haven't had it. Then I have a nail appointment, our soul cycle ride and like meet and greet tonight i'm so excited i feel like i haven't been on newberry street in a minute and it's so pretty out right now i'm about to meet maggie and arlen the matcha, the matcha is so good so we good. loaded ours up with cinnamon of course okay switching over to my phone because my camera freaking dies and i can't even take your guys's batteries because we all use different cameras now maggie has a sony one and he has big boy Big oh, Papa. also, I need to tell them, the lady was so sweet. Me and Arlen were just being nice and talking to her. I swear, it's because we were being nice and talking to her. I wasn't looking at her. Oh. <laughs> well, I was. I was making conversation. She was like, want a free coffee? And we were like, oh, okay. She was like, on the house. So be nice to people in service. This is your reminder today. Because some people are so mean to them, and I hate it. Look at them and say hi and ask them about their day. But... Also, we got this donut because it said it was gluten-free, so I told Arlen it's basically like a salad. <laughs> this is a salad. Back home. Sorry, that was unfortunate that my camera died. I don't know what got into me. I always change my camera batteries, and then I didn't, and my camera died. But it was really good to get matcha with Maggie and Arlen, and Emma was going to come meet us, but then I think she was busy and had to go do stuff after her. Here's my water bottle. Her workout class, cause she was gonna meet us. Cause she was already over there. But then, got my nails done at Treasured Hands. The lighting's really bright over there. Can you see? I want you guys to really see what they look like. I've gotten so many questions here now, you can see, about them. And I just posted a story. I go to Treasured Hands in Boston when I'm here. I honestly haven't gone there in so long, like so many months, because I think I kept getting them done in Albany because I kept visiting Albany. Then I just got them done in South Carolina. So, yeah, I haven't gone in so long. But I just love this light pink color. I can, like, never get anything else other than the light pink or else i miss the light pink but there we go they look kind of white on camera but it's just like a light pink white chalky color they just did such a good job and i feel honestly so out of it right now i feel like really shaky and like weird i think it's because i haven't had matcha in a while and so i'm like and i had a couple sips of that coffee that that lady gave us if you heard what i was saying and yeah i was just like making conversation with her she was like here's a coffee on the house so just like be nice to people. I was just in a chatty mood. But anyway, what I was going to say, I'm back home now. And I got this salad from Target the other day, you guys. You have probably had these before. I've never had one. I don't know how. You know when you go to a grocery, they have like, not pre-made salads, but they're like these salad mixes. And they come with like a dressing. This is like a Thai one. And Taylor said it was so good and she's had it before. And I'm like, I always buy like lettuce and then it goes bad because it's like daunting to me to make a whole salad. I don't know. She's like, you should try this. So I am and I really like it. It's really good. Do you guys like eat these? You know what? That can be today's question of the day. Yay, because I'm not going to forget anymore. Okay, today's question of the day. Do you, yeah, wait, this is such a good question. And I want detailed answers. I love reading your answers. So comment down your answer. Comment down below your answer. Do you guys, like this is like a bunch of questions in one. Do you eat out a lot? Do you eat at home a lot? When you do eat at home, are you making like full meals from like a cookbook? Are you like a chef? Or are you literally making like cereal and avocado toast? I feel like that's like most people like chill food that's like quick, like a PB&J. Like pre-made salad because I guess this is like eating at home but it's kind of pre-made pretty much for you. Yeah, I want to know what like the majority of you guys do i feel like so many people in this day and age just like eat out like when i was in college especially with a boyfriend with max we would just get bagels every morning chipotle every day for like dinner or lunch pizza burgers like we would just eat out for every single meal and i start to feel like crap like i feel so much better when i eat at home but to me it just takes so much time to like go to the grocery and like plan out and i am so bad at planning my meals like i don't and even if i did i feel like 
I would be like, oh, I really want Chipotle, and I would go pick up food out anyway on a day that I would like plan to eat something else. So, yeah, I don't know. And then you have to cook, and then what if you don't get all the stuff you need, and then you get stuff that you don't need, and it goes bad, and I don't know. That's why I really like stuff like HelloFresh. Um, this isn't sponsored by HelloFresh or anything, but you guys just know that I always get that because it's like eating at home, but not as like daunting, and like the recipes are already prepared for you. But yeah, do you guys do that do you meal prep because i know a lot of people do that i don't know if i could do that either because then it's like all a lot of cooking in one day but i know it makes so much sense for like the week you guys have tips for me let me know <laughs> alexa pause <laughs> i want to be in like a chill zen vibe today before our like crazy hectic class right now but this is what i feel like right now i feel like i was trying to say it before i ate my salad and I realized I don't know if my message came across. I said I didn't have matcha in a while. And so I feel like really anxious right now. And it's so weird because I feel like only coffee used to do that to me. But now it must be matcha too. Oh, I, did I say that? And because I drank some of the coffee that she gave us. But my heart just feels like this and my hands feel shaky and I feel weird. And I feel like I need to eat like carbs or something because of it. Will that like make it go away? Like I'm drinking a lot of water. I ate a salad. But I'm feeling weird. <laughs> I just need to be productive. Like I feel like I could go zip around and run like <laughs> right now. But I need to chill because tonight's gonna be crazy. Oh, and me and Maggie were talking about it. We were saying for a song we wanna do tonight. Um, I feel like before we picked like all the songs in the playlist, but we always just love Sarah's class and I love her music because she does a mix of like oldies, but goodies and like new music and just like all sorts of genres and stuff. So I kind of want to let her just like take the reins. But me and Maggie were saying, what she said, there's one. Oh yeah, she said she wanted Bad Idea by Ariana Grande and I've done that in Sarah's class before and it's so quick and it's like you do a bunch of runs and like jumps to it and I'm so nervous it's going to be literally crazy. But, okay, what I was going to say, you guys, is I haven't done laundry since I've gotten back from being away all of November. Probably, like, three loads to do. That's something no one would know before tonight that the set I'm going to wear is, like, quickly going to be washed right now. Usually, I hang it dry, but I'm, like, definitely not going to have time. So, laundry is a big priority right now. Let's do it. You guys, this is, like, packed. This is going to be, like, three loads, I feel like. Oh, boy. I made a little PB&J as a snack. I'm gonna go like that, just on an English muffin. Also, my Sephora package came in these big slip silk scrunchies you can't get in store, so I had to order them. And right after I ordered them from Sephora, people were telling me they were on sale for Black Friday and Cyber Monday on their website, which, yeah, that's sad, and now the sale's over. But I will have these linked down below in case you guys are interested, because normally I wear, oh yeah, it's on right now just the thin one like every day there was like some perfume samples and yeah i just really wanted to try out the big ones i think they're so cute i just love the silk i sleep on their silk pillowcase every night too and then i just got this mini under eye concealer try it out i feel like i've used this before but um that girl i follow <laughs> that girl this girl i follow on instagram you guys probably know her danny austin she was talking about it the other day she was saying that the nars um, no, the Tarte Shape Tape she thought was, like, really thick under her eyes and would, like, settle into, like, her creases and was, like, drying, and I kind of feel like that, too, and that's what I use, so I decided that I would give the NARS one a go again, because I'm pretty sure I've used it in the past, and I don't remember how I felt, but, yeah, I just thought I would try that out, so... That's just a little package I got some from Sephora. Normally, I would just go because all I really wanted were like these, but they don't have them in the store. So, yeah. Oh, you can hear my laundry going. Yeah, Taylor's coming home soon. I'm excited to see her. Turned on the Christmas tree. The sun is like going down, you guys. And it is 3.55. That is so sad how dark it gets here so early, but yeah. I'm getting like nervous for this soul cycle ride. Like it's so exciting, but like I just feel like I have to be so on because like I don't know. But I'm really excited too. Like it's like the best energy, but like <clears throat> especially since we have like a whole like meetup and taking photos together at the end and stuff, like if I 
like have to pee or I'm hungry or cold or anything and like look weird at all people will think that I'm like upset and I like never want that to happen so yeah I just get like nervous but it's gonna be like so exciting and so many of my friends are coming Natalie can't because she is babysitting so she said she can't come and I am too but Taylor is going to come my friend Caitlin my friend Louisa my friend Addie Arlen's coming I think Maggie's friend Marcus is coming it's gonna be Guys, this is so funny. I'm watching Max's game while I'm doing my laundry. If <laughs> you hear the announcers. Oh, also, I just opened this package from Maritzia and then these tights. I'm gonna try on in a bit and show you guys. I'm just getting my life together. Team, the Reading Royals are. We've got some guys that can really shoot. We've already talked about Kademi, but let's go slow shoot the puck there either. Max Wilman, it's only his third goal, but he's a, a good looking player. Freaking out. And he'll get a power play goal at the 1430 mark. So That's a good omen. We have to leave for a ride in a little. And I was feeling tired, so I put on a robe and was chilling. Guys, Max just scored. That was so cool. Look at a quad. Here we go. Wait, I'm so excited that we have you for photos and videos. Oh, yeah. Because yeah, it's going to be so good. Big guy. Big Taylor is here. Yeah. Maggie's here. Yeah. Marcus is back. <laughs> Did you get a haircut? Yeah. It looks really good. I like it. And off we go. There's probably only like eight more minutes until the class starts, but it's okay. We'll just stroll in. Brooke's there. I forgot to say her earlier. I was telling everyone that I was going. Taylor. No, you're good. Taylor, KP, Louisa, Addie, Brooke. So many people are coming. Also, I should have put makeup on now that I see you with makeup. No, it's okay. I only did a little, a little something something. Arlen's first Gretchen X Maggie X Soul Cycle ride. Um, I told him he has no idea what the energy is going to be like. What is it like, Taylor, in there? How would you describe it? Are they going to be actually like, screaming? Crazy. It's just really like good energy. Will they be screaming? Like, like not during the class. In? No. Okay. No one's going <laughs> to scream when we walk. No, so it's guys, very, it's very like low key. It's wondering. chill. Guys, we just got so matching sets. We're like changing in the back room. Class is about to start. I feel like I can't breathe. We're like rushing so much. But we got the cutest red sets. They have like pink at the top. And we're deciding that we're all going to match. Sarah's wearing it too. So is Maddie. Hi, Cookie. That was so good. That was good. That went by in literally 20 seconds. Didn't that go by so quick? Yeah. That went by so quick. Here we were. Running in at the last moment. I was like putting up my hair as the song was like starting. That was so good. Yeah. <laughs> there you go, Gertchen. Thank you. Thank you for being cameraman. You're welcome. Thank you for being the best friend ever and waiting. And you weren't even on photo duty today. You got to chill. <sighs> you guys, that was the most insane night. I don't know why it felt like it went by in 30 seconds. Like it was all a blur. I don't remember a single thing or a song or anything. It was just like, woo! But. It was literally so fun, and I'm so happy that so many of my friends could come. And these sets we were not expecting at all, so thank you so much, Soul Cycle, because they're so cute and they're so cute for like the holidays. And me and Sarah and Maggie were all matching, so I literally love these so much. That was so thoughtful of them. And I actually, this is so funny, I got this um, set from Soul Cycle when I was in Long Island earlier this week because I was like, oh, I can wear this to my ride. So I was going to wear. This set from Soul Cycle, in case you're wondering, but now I can just wear it to other classes. And it's so cute because it has their little skull on the back. So, yeah. What a great day. 
orange. Yeah, do you like it? Yeah, it's good. Wait, am I holding them down? I got a bunch of new cases. My cases, I have to show you them. Um, yeah, says Gretchen. I know I showed you guys that though. Okay, ready? Hang on, guys. <laughs> that was Max's goal, and um, one of you guys was there, and I'm so happy that you DM that to me. And this was it, like on their Twitter. But the other, oh, so cool. The other, oh, <laughs> that was me and Maggie at all. Um, but yeah, this is such a good angle of it. So, if you ever go to his games, send me photos of him or videos. Especially if I'm not there because I'm gonna be so jealous. And oh my god, I'm seeing all these photos from tonight. So cute. Ah! I'm so happy that we got the red bow matching sets because it made the photos so fun. And yeah. Maggie and I walking out of the studio, we're having like a chat for her vlog, so make sure you go watch her vlog. But basically, we were just like, this is just so crazy if you really think about it because I remember like a year and a half ago, we would always talk about how we wanted to do these rides. I'm sure I've talked about this before. I always talked about how I wanted to do it. And then one day, we just did it, and now that was our third or fourth, I forget which one. And just thank you all all of you so much for supporting me and believing in me and coming to my class and like taking the time out of your day this one girl lauren she's so sweet lauren when you're watching this love you and she was like i sped here after class it took me like an hour and a half and i'm like that is so cute like you did not have to take the time out of your day but you did and yeah i just love hanging out with you guys and getting to talk to you and it was so fun. And thank you to SoulCycle and all the SoulCycle staff because they are incredible. And we wouldn't be able to do SoulCycle without them. Instructor Sarah, obviously, I love her. It was so fun. And yeah, guys, just manifest your dreams because, I mean, it's not that simple, but I'm just in the manifest mood because I've been around Arlen a lot and I always listen to Tori's podcast about manifestation and it really like inspires me like yeah just you have to like put it out there into the universe and you never know you could be doing exactly what you wanted to do a year ago and then it's just crazy how life happens like that also i was just so excited when we were walking to the building because um i was like taylor i don't know like what i want like should i have gone to my old woods i don't know and i forgot she got sushi earlier and she got me this chicken that I like that I, I know definitely isn't good for me but it's so good and I'm so happy that it's here because I forgot about it. It's called General, it's like different everywhere. General Sao, General Tao, General Gao chicken. Bomb, so good. At any sushi place, get it because it's going to be amazing. It honestly tastes kind of like sesame chicken. I'm so excited right now. Oh, I think I got a cucumber avocado roll too. I don't know how I forgot about that. I just feel like my head is spinning. That was like the craziest night ever. And just so much fun. Hi! Hi! You wonder what I think is funny? I'm vlogging you right now, if you couldn't tell. How I was telling them about manifesting things. And I feel like me and Maggie manifested these rides a little bit. Because we always talked about it. And your goal tonight is a perfect example. You literally said, I am manifesting a goal tonight. And guess who freaking scored a goal? You yeah, did. I guess so. It's as simple as that. You just got to say it. You just got to put it out into the universe and it could come back in your favor. You never know. You know? Yeah. Hi, cut nose. <laughs> it's all frozen. In the face. You got hit in the face? Am I frozen? Yeah. Okay, honestly, I can't really look scary, but I swear it's so good, you guys. Like, it just looks like sesame chicken without the chicken. This is more, like, aesthetically pleasing. I like the cucumber. What is this called? avocado roll sometimes because I'm just going back to the basics and I'm whoa when I miss it it's so fuzzy but yep that's dinner yeah we're doing a big lie down watching our fate a big what do you say big nine nine a big nine nine <laughs> you know it's bedtime when your bun <clears throat> is on this phase of the night Literally what? Also, if you can tell, I'm using one of my new hair ties. Did I get that today? That feels like days ago. Oh my gosh, I never tried on my new jeans and tights. I showed you guys their jeans from Aritzia. They're Goldie. A Goldie jeans are my favorite. And shorts. And then the tights I got from Essence. Like S and then Sense. That's like the name of the 
website. I didn't look at it at all, so I don't even know what kind of website it is. All I know is, um, you guys know I follow Danny Austin on Instagram. Can I not with my bun right now? And she was talking about these Gucci tights, and I swiped up, and I bought them immediately because I needed them. And, like, I have a plan. I'm going to wear them to the Nutcracker. If you made it to the end of this vlog, I'm going to the Nutcracker with Max. And I can't wait. It's, like, literally one of my favorite things to do and you guys know we just had so much fun at Hamilton we're like big theater people now I don't know no but we went to Nutcracker last year I go every year it's literally like just one of my favorite things it's just so fun and like it was one of my favorite dates to this day um also if you saw that little clip of me and Taylor were watching Aspen and Parker in her room and it reminds me back in the day in college <laughs> lol in college when we lived together like sophomore and junior year we would like cuddle in her bed together and watch like aspen and parker or the bachelor or the bachelorette or whatever and yeah that was really fun and i love her and i love living with her last thing i want to show you is our tree i'm just not over it i think i've been so happy and such good vibes because of this tree it's just been making my day every day i'm not kidding like it's just bringing me so much joy i don't know why it's just getting me in the holiday spirit, making me happy. But I'm going to end off today's vlog here. It was so crazy. I'm going to sleep so well. Oh, and actually tomorrow morning we're going to Pilates and we're actually going to go this time. Rain or shine. Well, snow or no snow. <laughs> and yeah, we're actually going to go because we were supposed to go on Tuesday. And then we did it. <laughs> but yeah, our ride tonight was absolutely incredible and i just was going through all of your guys instagrams and stalking you and liking your photos and commenting them and reposting all your stories and it was just like the highlight of my life but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you tomorrow for vlogmas day bye oh my gosh yeah at the end of every video i'm gonna be like wow this is going by so quick but it really is okay